Robert, you also mentioned to me back in December that you wanted to take advantage of the lower prices of gold and silver and buy more. You also said, quote, when the stock market goes down, panic will set in and gold and silver are likely to hit new highs. When do you expect this turnaround to happen, Robert? Well, that's a great question. I don't buy gold and silver because I expect it to go up. I buy gold and silver for a number of reasons. Reason number one, I don't trust my government. You know, as long as they're printing money, I'd rather have gold and silver. You know, um, I don't think the dollar or the loonie or the euro will be around much longer anyway. It may, maybe five years, maybe 10 years. But we cannot, you know, we cannot keep doing what we're doing, printing money. The other thing, too, as the stock market goes up and the price of gold goes down, uh, if I was if I was a trader, if I was actually playing those sports, I would always be buying the opposite side of it. So when the, the price of stocks going up, price of gold is going down, I'm on the other side. And, and the other thing is I don't buy gold and silver because I want to play the stock. I play gold, gold and silver because it's real money. That's the only reason. So when the price of it goes down, naturally I'm going to buy more of it. Robert, do you care where gold is headed? Uh, I'll just say it again. I don't trust my government. 